so hello and welcome back to another video and uh, this video is going to be very helpful for the students those who are appearing for the hcl tech hiring process uh, and uh, this is going to be very important for those i'll be telling you uh, all about the hiring process test patterns and everything okay so before going towards the hiring process if you are new in our youtube channel so please do subscribe our channel and like the video because we will be bringing this type of helpful videos for you in the upcoming days okay so let's begin with the hiring process and uh, i think uh, those who are watching this video you might have received mail or if you haven't received the mail about the hcl tech so you will definitely going to receive the mail for the test and this time hcl is uh, conducting their test in hacker earth okay so I'll be telling you everything hiring process and what will be the pattern and assignments. Okay, so we will be having the first that is the online assignment and uh, it will have a duration of nearly 120 to 180 minutes. And let's break down the sections on which sections the questions are going to ask this time. Okay, so the questions will be from the aptitude. Okay, like quantitative aptitude, logical reasoning questions will be there. These are the questions from the aptitude and you will be having 30 30 questions or nearly uh, this uh, amount of questions you will be seeing and the timing will be one minute per question and the timing I, a timer will be not uh, like specifically uh, given to a question it will be like you will get 30 minutes so you have to solve 30 minutes you have to solve 30, 30 questions okay so uh, these are the two sections apart from this we will be having a verbal ability questions it will also contain nearly 30 questions with 30 minutes of timeline and uh, technical mcqs will be there so basically these all things are going to be mcq based questions you have to choice uh, you have you will be having choice and you have to choose one of the best okay after this we will uh, uh, you will see two two to three coding questions and uh, you will uh i think there will be only two questions of the coding this time i think because previously there were a lot of a uh, lot of the things that have been changed this time okay so expectations are that you will get only two coding questions and uh, you will be allowed to code in c c plus plus java python and whatever language you are coding with okay so you will be eligible for this languages okay and if you qualify the first assignment uh, online assignment uh, process if you qualify this test so you will be like eligible for the uh, that is the second round uh, uh, you will be eligible for the communication round in the previous year uh, hcl has uh, conducted gd though uh, the students those who qualify the first assessment they have conducted a gd in on campus for filtering the students but this time they have put a communication round instead of the GD. Okay, so this is going to be also elimination round. Once you complete this communication round, uh, if you qualify, you will be having technical interview one round, uh, technical interview one and technical interview two. There will be two different technical interviews, TR1 and TR2. And in the technical interview first, you will be having duration of 45 to 60 minutes uh, and uh, uh, you will be getting a zoom a zoom meeting link or uh, google meet link anywhere they can conduct the meet uh, interview okay so you will receive the mail if you qualify this and uh, the mostly the focused area uh, in the tr1 is like programming fundamentals like whatever your domain language is the questions will be arise from that and uh, data structure and algorithm questions will be there data based concepts and sql concept will be there object oriented uh, uh, programming questions you will be seeing projects they will discuss for your projects problem solving approaches and everything in the uh, in the technical round one and this is not going to be very uh, easy so you have to uh, prepare for everything everything means everything and once you uh, qualify this tech tr1 you will be uh, getting email for the tr2 and uh, the duration will be like 30 to 45 minutes and this tr2 will be more difficult as compared to tr1 because here uh, like uh, for senior roles they will be hiring they will be checking if you are really eligible for the senior role or not 
So uh, the focus areas will be advanced programming concepts, system design fundamentals, technological stack, uh, and the, if you know deeply or not, code, code optimization techniques you know or not, and architecture patterns. So these are the, some of the focused areas where you will be seeing the questions in the TR2. And once you qualify both these rounds, TR1 and TR2, you will be having a simple HR interview and it will be not that much uh, time taking and simple questions like your background and education verification will be the con company's culture alignment if you are aligned with the company's culture or not, career aspiration and normal HR questions will be there. Okay, so these are the some uh, like sections or the some of the level of uh, hiring process patterns that you will be seeing in this uh, chill drive okay and most importantly if you have you have to like you have to pass this assignment online assessment round and uh, once you qualify this you will be seeing the communication round and these are elimination round so you have to prepare well for everything so best of luck for your exams best of luck for your test if you are having your test uh, okay so that's all for the day please do like the video if you want more such videos and subscribe our channel thank you